God said, let there be light, and there was light, and it come to pass. But you remember, before earth and all of this come into existence, it was all in God's mind. But now it's just being played out and it being manifested. Amen. So Satan had thoughts also in his mind, what he wants to do. Amen. Satan thoughts did not start here on earth. Satan thoughts started when he was in heaven. Is that right? And that's what we actually just read. Satan telling what I'm going to do. But what's so interesting, when, uh, when you look at the scripture and you go to the message Satan's eating, the prophet said God eating was established in righteousness. Satan eating is established in sin because Satan is sin. God is righteous. And God's kingdom was established in righteousness and peace and life. And Satan's establishment is in sin and religious sin. I like how he just adding it in, in sin, religious sin. He said, now notice how he deceived his deception as he said he would. And then he said he promised to do this. Then he refers to Isaiah. So what Satan was saying in Isaiah, I'm gonna be like the Mo High, Satan was making a promise. In other words, I promise you, this is what I'm going to do. God got promises and the devil got promises. But the only difference is here, God promises is to bless you. Satan promises to bless himself. That's the only difference. Can we say amen? Even when you look in the scripture, Satan say, I will be like the most high. I will ascend into heaven. I will exalt my throne. I will sit upon the mount. All of those are Satan's eyes. But then when you go to the book of Ezekiel, God got eyes. God said, I will take away your stony heart. I will give you a new spirit. God said, I will do this. I will call you from the nation. But the only difference, Satan's eyes is for himself. But God's eyes is for you. God said, I'm going to do this for you. I'm going to take care of you. I'm going to change you. But Satan said, all of my eyes is for me.